नमस्ते एवरी वन लेट अस सी फ्यू क्वेश्चन ऑफ सरकम फ्रेंड्स ऑफ सर्कल एंड द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज द मून इज नियरली थ्री लैख एटी फाइव थाउजेंड किलोमीटर्स अवे फ्रॉम द अर्थ इट टेक्स अराउंड ऑफ द अर्थ एवरी मंथ हाउ मच डिस्टेंस डज इट ट्रेवल इन वन मंथ लेट अस सी द सोल्यूशन अ रेड डॉट इज देयर ऑन द बोर्ड लेट इट इज अर्थ and a black dot is there let it is moon and the distance between earth and moon is 385000 kilometers it takes one month for the one revolution so the distance covered in one month will be the circumference of this circle means we have to find out circumference here so we are given that let us see the solution part the radius of the circle if a is earth and b is moon the ab that is radius of the circle will be 385000 kilometers and the total length of boundary is the center and the total length of boundary will be circumference of circle so circumference will be you know the formula it is 2 pi r 2 pi multiplied by radius so we know pi is 22 upon 7 and radius is 3 lakh 85000 km that is 3 lakh 85000 now simplify it 7 on the 7 then 7 5 the 35 3 left therefore Seven fives are thirty-five again, and this will be fifty-five thousand. Now multiply it, and the distance covered by moon will be twenty-four lakh twenty thousand kilometers, which is your required solution. The next question is. The diameter of a wheel of a car is 35 cm. How much distance will it cover in 1000 revolutions? Let us see the solution part. We are given a wheel means we are given a circle. Its diameter is 35 cm. Now let us see it practically. Let the step roll will be a wheel. When it is moving on the road, its circumference part is touching the road. So, means in this question we have to find out the circumference of the circle first of all. So let us see the solution. It is question number six of your worksheet. What is given? Diameter equals to thirty-five centimeter, and circumference will be pi d. That is. Twenty-two upon seven multiplied by thirty-five. Seven one just seven. Seven five just thirty-five. And we know when diameter is given, pi d is the formula of circumference. So twenty-two five just one hundred ten centimeter. Now we have to find out. the distance covered in 1000 revolutions so in one revolutions it is covering 110 cm and 
डिस्टेंस कवर्ड इन 1000 रेवोल्यूशंस विल बी इन वन रेवोल्यूशन 100 हंड्रेड एन सो इन वन थाउजेंड रेवोल्यूशंस विल बी वन थाउजेंड इंटू वन हंड्रेड एन और वन हंड्रेड एन इंटू वन थाउजेंड विच इज इक्वल्स टू वन लैख टेन थाउजेंड सेंटीमीटर लेट एस कन्वर्ट इट इंटू मीटर्स सो वी नो दैट वन लैख टेन थाउजेंड सेंटीमीटर विल बी वन लैख टेन थाउजेंड अपॉन हंड्रेड मीटर विच इज इक्वल्स टू इलेवन हंड्रेड मीटर दिस इज योर रिक्वायर्ड आंसर The next one is radius of a wheel of a bus is 0.70 meter. How many revolutions will it take in covering 22 km? We are given a wheel of bus again. Remember this question is little opposite to the previous question. So here radius is 0.70. If O is the radius then The radius of wheel is 0.70 meters. Then we have to find out that in how many revolutions will it cover 22 kilometers. So first of all we have to find out the circumference. As I discussed in the previous question only circumference will touch the ground. So here radius of circle radius equals to 0.70 meter and circumference will be 2 pi r which is equals to 2 multiplied by pi is 22 upon 7 and radius is 0.70 then divide it 7 ones are 7 so it is 0.10 multiply it the answer will be 4.4 meters now let us suppose that number of revolutions means let us suppose that it takes n revolutions to cover 22 km so let the number of revolutions will be n the distance covered in n revolutions will be n multiplied by 4.4 So this distance is given equals to twenty-two kilometers, but our circumference is in meters. So let us convert. We know that one kilometer equals to one thousand meters, and therefore twenty-two kilometer will be twenty-two multiplied by one thousand, which is equals to twenty. 2000 meters now let us see according to the question n into 4.4 is given equal to 22000 meters here we have to find out n so first of all remove decimal it is 44 upon 10 and right hand side as it is now to find out n we have to take 44 upon 10 to the right hand side so 10 will go in multiply and 44 will go in divide so 22 ones are 22 and 22 twos are 44 and 2 on the 2 2 5 is 10 means we got 
revolutions is our required answer the next question is a wire is in the form of a circle with radius 42 cm it is bent into a square find the side of the square so we are given a wire in the form of a circle we know the length of this wire will be the circumference of the circle but first of all let us see the given part we are given a circle with radius 42 cm so the radius of the circle will be 42 cm means the radius of this wire is 42 cm we have to find out the length of boundary that is circumference so length of boundary will be the length of wire that is circumference of circle and we know the formula is 2 pi r where r is radius so it is 2 multiplied by 22 upon 7 multiplied by 42 which is radius so 7 6 of 42 and therefore length of the wire is 264 cm now this 264 cm will be bent in the form of a square now let us bend it and convert in the form of a square so what will happen when it is converted in the form of a square the length of boundary is 264 cm again length of boundary of a square is called perimeter and this perimeter is given equals to 264 cm now so the formula for the perimeter is 4 multiplied by side so 4 into side is 264 and the side will be equals to 264 upon 4 that is 66 cm means the side of square is 66 cm this is your required answer thank you and keep smiling